Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create a new page in Wix website. But before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, how do we create our new page here in our Wix website? Well, creating a new page is pretty simple here, but there might be some variations depending on your the current functionality of your website. But in this case, let's go ahead and access our Wix website here. So in this case, go ahead and access or log in into your Wix account. And you want to click on the sign site at the top right of your screen. Now, in here, what we need to do next is we need to access the left side here. So you should see a pages and menu icon. Go ahead and click on it and you should be able to see this drawer here. Now, what we need to do is we just need to basically click on the add page at the top right. Now, as you can see, this is since this is a shop that I have right now on my, on this case, my website is actually a shop. I have, I also have the option to add, or in this case, add a shop page, which in this case displays products from a specific category. If you want to create your, that specific kind, but if you want to create a different kind of, uh, page here, like for example, a contact page or a different, a whole set or a whole different page here, you can go ahead and click on the app page at the top right here. It's going to say adding a shop page. So it's going to start adding a specific page on your account here. So as you can see, it's now going to be added. But in this case, in some cases, it might be different. So in this case, uh, in some cases, like for example, if you have a different page or a different set of, like for example, if you just have a portfolio page, uh, it might be different for you. So just to give you an idea, so I'm going to actually switch over to a different website I have right now. So since I actually have a portfolio page here, just give you an idea on how it's going to look like. So in this case, let's go and click on our profile here. And from here, what we need to do is we need to, again, access our edit site here or our editor. So in here, what we need to do next is we just need to wait for it. So let's just wait for it real quickly. So we are now inside a page here. Click on pages and menu here. And just go and click on the option for our pages and you want to go ahead and basically click on add page at the top right now from here you could choose your page here like what i said before depending on the functionalities that you added for your website it might be different for you so in this case maybe i want to add a page for a classic resume or cv here and from here it's going to be added into our page here as you can see right now you could even add a name for it so just in case, like for example, you've actually clicked on done accidentally, you can still edit this by clicking on three dot icon here. And you can change a few things like renaming it. You can duplicate it if you want. You can change the page background if you want. But yeah, so in this case, once you've added your page here, once you've added your name, you can go ahead and just start, just click on it and you should be able to start uh, changing a few things like the elements that you see here, pictures and whatever effects that you want to add. But in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.